Let's graph the linear equation 2x plus 6y equals 30. And we're going to use slope-intercept form to do this. You could use a table of values. It would work. You'd get the same answer. But this is a good bit easier. What we need to do then is rearrange 2x plus 6y equals 30 into slope-intercept form here. So I'm going to subtract 2x from both sides. And then let's take and divide both sides by 6. That'll give us x all by itself. So 6 divided by 6, we just end up with y equals 30 divided by 6 is 5. And then minus 2 over 6, we could reduce this to minus 1 third x. Then let's put this first. And now we have slope-intercept form, and we can graph it pretty easily. We have the y-intercept. That's where we cross the y-axis right here at 5. And then the slope, that's the rise over the run. So let's consider the negative sign up here on the one, and we go, and we go to our y-intercept, and we go negative one. So instead of rising, since it's negative, we go down one over one, two, three, four, five, and that's our second point. We could do it again. Then we could go down one and over one, two, three, four. Five. We're off the graph, but you can see that we could extend our graph paper and put a line through this. And that would give us the equation for 2x plus 6y equals 30. So you'd want to extend your graph paper out here some in this case. But that's it. This is Dr. B using slope-intercept form here to graph the equation 2x plus 6y equals 30. If you used a table of values, you'd get the same general line here. Thanks for watching.